So hey guys and welcome back to EV with Rafiq. So the continuation of the previous video, in this video we will be going to paint our bicycle. As I mentioned earlier, we will be going to paint it in gold and black color. So I'm going to use the spray paints, this one, gold and black to paint the bicycle, okay? So to start before that, what I did was, I went to a paint local paint store and I made this bicycle frame get sanded, okay? Yeah, I wasn't having sandpaper of 2000 grade. So if you have a 2000 grade sandpaper, wet sandpaper, use that and grade it. So let's see, this becomes soft, okay? The frame should become soft, like it should become even. Then the paint coating will look very good, okay? So first step is grinding it and making it a smooth finish. Next. Next, what we'll be going to do is, we'll be going to hang a string. I'm going to use this metal string, you can see, okay? This metal string. Okay, I'm going to use this to hang the bicycle over here. Okay, so we can spray paint it neatly. Okay, so let's get started with the hang up part. So, first off, just unwind this and with a guess, okay, I'm just using a stool. Look at this. Fine. Now, okay, now let's keep the stool aside for now and Let's take the frame. So to hang the frame, I'm taking my brother's help. So this is my brother, Razak. So the hanging part is pretty much done. Now let's do the spraying part, okay? So first off to spray, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a white paint, okay? I just want to make it a white for now. Just a single coat, okay? So before using before using a spray paint or spray can, first check it well. So, before getting started with the paint job, what we really need is a safety. This is a gloves, this is a mask, and these are some gloves, okay? So let me just get up fast, then we can start with the work. These are some pretty tight gloves, okay? Don't mind this. Next, mask, compulsory, because we don't need to inhale. Before using paint, check it well. And let's give it an even coat of white, okay? Okay, I guess this is much only white paint we have got, so that's okay. So let's give it some time to dry. Then we're going to give it a gold paint. We're going to go with the first coat directly, okay? So let it be there. Let's, have, let's go hang it over there. Now, what we'll do is, we will hang this over here. We'll be hanging it over here. Hmm? Okay, we'll be hanging it over here and we'll be giving it a black directly. You should be careful with this. So, let's go up and start hanging the process. Do the hanging process. So, before getting started, let's take a cloth and wipe it. Okay, wipe it in and out. I made my gloves as a finger gloves, no problem. Should be careful with this. Shake it. Okay, let's keep it like this. And let's go. First, let's try it out, okay. Okay, it's cool. And let's go. Just be careful, okay? This is just the first coat, okay guys? So we will probably do a second coat to this. Cool, yeah, the rim looks absolutely beautiful. Okay guys, so I just hang the second, second rim. You can see the first rim, single coat, good. We gotta coat it again, just let it dry. I'm using the same spray can. So we're going to paint black to this rim also. Before painting, as always, Take a cloth and wipe it. Get an even coat, okay? So while spray painting, that's important. If you don't go too close, no you to go too, be too far, okay? If we be too close, we will have paint like lumps. I mean, it will be excessive paint over there in that region, so that won't look good. And if we be too far, 
it paint won't be enough. I mean, it won't be that close to get to it. I'm sorry. While working, it's hard to, you know, speak. Cool. Okay, so as you guys can see, both the rims are done, good. And for this, the frame, it's dried, cool. We're gonna give it a single coat of gold. Then, we'll give it a double coat, cool. I'm gonna take a gold, fine. First, let's remove it. Let's do this. And just in the air, try if it is coming cool, clean or no. Yeah, it's coming clean, right? Be careful. And wherever you want to start, you can start, okay? Or for you guys to see it, okay, let's start it with the back. Yeah, I guess we gave it a pretty decent single coat. Hmm, cool. Just from the inside, okay? Yep. So, here it is, guys. This is looking great. The frame looks neat. We need a second coat on this. Really good, but let's first begin with this okay let's clear up the rims first we'll give them a second coat then we'll go to the frame okay and by the way i painted the handle it's over here and the front suspension also so we'll head up to the frame at the end before that let's finish the gold i mean sorry the black okay so let me remove this you can see okay let me bring closer in the first coat itself it gave us a pretty good just over here, we need blue, if you can see, because we were hanging it in that side. And the remaining part, I guess it turned out good. Yep, it turned out great, guys. Not a problem. Yeah, and here, one part. Okay, so to this, we're going to give a second coat, fine? First, let's give it half, dry it, then let's give the other half, okay? So let me take my black back, it's cool. Oh, okay, black is over there. So what I'll do is, before starting, I'll keep this ring here safe, okay. I am taking a tape, a paper tape. I'm wrapping this up so that this doesn't give us a mark. To make sure that our rim doesn't get any, you know, lines or marks of this because of this thing. I don't want that to happen. So, yeah. So, yep, this is done. This looks pretty good. Hmm. Right, I gave it some extra. I'm going to do the same for that one also. So, before that, let's do for this. And I'm taking a cloth and first off, wipe it. Because we did gold, right? So some dust particles flew on it, obviously. Few of the particles from the paint flew on it and yeah, it's actually shining a bit. Like it's like gold, gold type. Okay, let's keep it reverse. And let's squeeze it in one of the hole. Oh, wait, let's get hanging. Yep, it's hooked. And we are ready to paint. Paint it. I'm going to turn like this because I don't want any black on this frame. Okay, let's get the straight done. It's looking great, actually. Amazing, guys. Just few touches here and there, that's it. I'm checking, do we need blue anywhere? I mean, can we see blue anywhere so that I can black it up? 
nope it's good it's great great now let's go with the second one okay check out the status of this interior looks bit clean okay and in the exterior sorry it looks pretty neat too just one two oh that's it yep we can paint it up this so we can do it we can add the touches and we can add the flare over <laughs> okay so this goes in back this is the suspension this is masking paper newspaper and tape i'll peel it and show you that it looks so satisfying let's leave it to dry it's almost done okay it's so hot guys today like really hot don't believe me i'm sweating way badly so now let's go to the next part okay so the rims are completed they look very good so the painting of the rims is completely done in the next video i'll show you what i'll be doing with this rims okay now we got to do the second coat of this frame first coat itself looks good but let's give it a second coat so that we get a proper smooth finish okay so as you all know before getting started first off check the paint spray well next from a farther distance first leave some air yes it's good now start The second coat of this is done. In this video, I'm going to wrap it up right now over here. In the next video, I'll be showing you with this hub motor how to fix this hub motor. Let me come here. Yeah, how to fix this hub motor over here? Like, how, uh, which length of uh, spoke should we use? What is the exact length which we need for this? Because obviously, the change of hub is going to decrease the size of uh, spokes. So we're going to do that in the next video. So to stay connected, go subscribe to the channel right now. I'll see you guys in the next video.